All right, top of the day. This is your boy, Big Rich, and this is another Ruckus Radio Report. Slain mob boss Frank Cali laid to rest as authorities look on. The murdered head of the Gambino crime family was buried on Staten Island on Tuesday after a service attended by a little more than a dozen mourners, all under the watchful eye of authorities armed with high-powered cameras across the street. Around 9.30 a.m., several cars, including black Mercedes and a Chevy Suburban, pulled up to the Scarpacy Funeral Home in Tottenville and drove around back for a service for Francisco Frankie Boy Cali. A gray Maserati remained in front of the funeral home as its male driver hopped out and went inside, leaving a woman dressed in black in the car. Meanwhile, four unmarked black law enforcement cars were parked across the street, each with a male driver armed with a handheld radio that they used to communicate with each other and cameras with 500 millimeter lenses about a foot wide. As the cars drove by, the authorities snapped photos. At least two of them confirmed to the post they were law enforcement and a source separately said they were both FBI and NYPD. Quote, that's just standard investigation 101, the source said. They want to know who shows up, who the players are, who's going to possibly take over, who's active, who's not the pecking order. Unfortunately, it's very limited, but they have to take what they can get. Then at 10.30 a.m. on the dot, cars began racing from the funeral home and headed to the cemetery in New Drop where Callie was buried. So the funeral was yesterday afternoon, and again, slain mob boss Frank Callie laid to rest as authorities look on, possibly looking for someone that might be the new Don. This is your boy Big Rich, and this is another Ruckus Radio Report. Please like, share, comment, and subscribe. Thank you so much, and everybody have a great morning.